What is the most important thing about practicing the mucusless diet healing system? I would argue that the most important thing about the practice itself is that of the transition diet and the methodology that goes along with transition dieting. So today, I'm going to bring you a delectable recipe. This is one of the joys of being on this path, making these kind of recipes. Yet, we must think in terms of transition and not go to extremes. So I'm going to address some of you that may be a bit more on the extreme side of things. It's okay, we're here for you. Some folks read the mucus's diet, they see that on Arnold Eretz says that mono fruit, that one type of fruit eaten in season is all that we are ever supposed to eat as human beings that just because our bodies are designed for fruit, we need to get to an all fruit diet as soon as humanly possible. See, see that sounds smart. <laughs> That's it. No, no discussion. No, no transition. No, nothing. Just, just hurry up. What we see time and time again when people have this kind of attitude is they don't last very long. Unfortunately, generally, they think it's a long time because it'll be two, three, four years. That's not 20 years. That's not 30 years. <laughs> I've done this for 21 years. Brother Aaron's done this for over 40 years. And we both advocate practicing of the transition diet. Now, what's all this preamble about? In this recipe, this this is, it's, this is such a nice recipe. It includes essentially two, technically three ingredients, technically two ingredients, depending on how you look at it. It is combining a couple different kinds of fruit together to make a very tasty transitional item. But I'm spending this time to address some of you that will be like, it's not mono, it's not mono fruit. Oh, whatever. So let me read you a bit from Arnold Eric. This is from the Mucus's Diet Healing System. This is is lesson 17, Transition Diet, part three, in the annotated, edited, and revised version of the Mucus's Diet. In nature, such as exists in the animal kingdom, there are absolutely no mixtures at all. The ideal and most natural method of eating is the mono diet. One kind of fresh fruit when in season should constitute a meal and you will find yourself better nourished. This condition, of course, cannot take place until you have thoroughly cleansed your body of toxemic poisons, mucus, or call it foreign substances. Now, this is from Transition Diet Part Two. I differ from the raw food fanatics because the food value is not important in a diet of healing. It is of more importance that the patient should and shall enjoy his or her change of diet during the transition until their tastes and conditions have improved. Now think about that word enjoy. Meditate on the word enjoy for a moment. Did you know that you're allowed to enjoy your transition? Did you know that you are allowed to blissfully enjoy the transitional process, including the mucus lean items? Are you being serious? Yes, we eat mucus forming foods as a part of the transition. Yes, we can have fruit salads that combines more one fruit item in a meal. Yes, we can have meals that combine more than two or three things. That's what I'm talking about. Now, I'm making this point because we have a lot of folks in our community or that people that like to watch us that tend to be a bit more on the extremist sort of side of things. Now, if you've been doing this for 20, 30 years, I'm not talking to you. You figured out, you've already figured out what you wanna do and what you're doing. That's great. If you're just like year three, four, five, six, and you know, that might feel like a long time because I, I see things people post up like, oh yeah, I'm three years in. I'm never eating vegetables again. Only fruit for the rest of my life. Hey, hey, you're going too fast. I hope, I hope you, 
<laughs> that doesn't tend to be what works. What tends to work time and time again, no matter where you start from, no matter where you're trying to go, is applying the transitional methodology. Some of you sit there like, what, why? Why are you talking so long about this? We're, it's just strawberries and banana recipe. Because I know that there's gonna be some people in the comments talking about, I can't believe they're combining two more than one fruit together. What kind of mucusless is this? Supposed to be mono fruit meal. Blah, blah, blah. Most of the people that talk like that, they've never really read, read this and they truly don't understand transition diet. And unfortunately, as we've just had an, another instance this week of somebody that used to be so staunch, so hardcore, they would be in our private club, our little forum on Facebook, and they would criticize people. You're eating too many things put together and hurry up. You know, your transition doesn't take that long come on they just posted a picture of themselves eating bacon and eggs after years a number of years of not transitioning very well obviously now they're back in the pus world and we have a song for that another one bites the pus mm, 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 mm. another one bites the pus <laughs> And another one bites the pus. Hey, it's gonna get you too. Another one bites the pus if you don't transition. So unless you want this song to be sung about you. But you don't want that, Peter. Check out the transition. And without further ado, go down below, hit the like button, hit the share button. Got some free training if you wanna learn more about this transitional methodology. Go do that really quick. Oh, wait a second. Now, without further ado, I turn it over to Hannah and Mia for this very tasty, very delectable strawberries gone banana. Take it away. Hello, my name is Mia, Hannah, and today we're going to make a strawberry gone bananas bowl. We are going to need some bananas, strawberries, you can use a knife, jam, cutting board, you need a bowl for the bowl, yeah, bananas, and Oh, and this is beauty. I'm gonna start by cutting the strawberries. I love strawberries. They're my yeah, they're favorite. Best. They are so good, aren't they, Mia? Yes, they are the best. What do you like with your bananas? I like to sometimes eat a banana just by itself or with a strawberry. Strawberry jam on a banana is the best. Yep. What's your favorite thing on a strawberry? My favorite thing is because they're sweet, delicious, and a yummy snack if you're hungry. Yeah, I also love strawberry jam, not strawberry jam, strawberry. Mm -hmm. Everything's here. Strawberry, strawberry, strawberry. Just keep going with the strawberries until they're small enough, and then you just fill your bowl. Look at that! And I also like bananas with peanut butter. Mm -hmm. I love my big cutting board. <laughs> I love red strawberries. They're the best. You can just gobble, gobble them all day. We finished a whole ten of them mm -hmm. yesterday. Mm-hmm. But we had to save some for the video. So we did. had to. If not, we would have eaten all the strawberries. Yep. You can just keep cutting until you feel it's like you have enough strawberries. Have bananas bowl because there's bananas in the strawberry bowl. I feel like this is my last strawberry. Yeah, me too. I think I've got enough. Now I'm gonna get a banana. Oh, that's go. too big for my cutting board. <laughs> They're just the perfect color. Mm -hmm. and perfect, delicious here. We started our new travels mm -hmm. yesterday. Do you wanna go to Eric? Yeah, right. Because Eric is the best birthday party we've ever gone to. It's Eric's birthday. Mm -hmm. I want another strawberry. So much banana, very little strawberry. There's so much strawberry, very little banana in mine. And you can make as many bowls as you want. I think I'm done. I've got how much you can see. Now I've got to add the jam. Ooh, the jam. Strawberry jam. Strawberry jam, strawberry is the best. You need a bit more. Uh, now I'm gonna mix. Oh, you're mixing with them. Can she do that? <gasps> yeah, we don't have any spoons, of course, right now. 
We're gonna eat that. Oh, it's been quartz. Look at that. Jam filled delight. Perfect. Eat it. If you don't like star jam, you can add any jam. Whatever jam's good. Tastes delicious either way. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye. Mm, mm, mm. Yes. Yes. That looks really good. And I want to thank Hannah and Mia. Go down below in the comments. Show your love to Hannah and Mia for sharing this delectable strawberries gone banana bowl with us today. An excellent transitional item. And this can give you a perspective about different kinds of recipes that you can create for yourself. You know, I'm not a big fan of having a whole lot of different things in a bowl in, in, a, in terms of a fruit salad but a few things three four different kinds of fruit if they combine okay if they eliminate okay that's the main thing the main thing name of the game is does it eliminate well i hope you were paying attention if you eat a recipe and combine a couple things together and you notice that you have heartburn and indigestion or your stomach feels a little weird the next day, then stop eating that combination. It's not a one size fits all thing. Some food combinations are going to eliminate very well in one person and then the other person standing next to them will be like, ah, man, I can't eat that. That gets, that bothers my stomach. And so don't sweat the small stuff. Enjoy your transition. Enjoy the sun enjoy the air enjoy your breath enjoy this planet let's clean ourselves up let's rid our body of the abominations and in putrid and <laughs> putrid nasty mess and let's ascend let's rise above the parasites and the pus and the low frequency living the low frequency vibrational mindsets we don't need that anymore it's time to vibrate on a higher level so let's get to it so again thank you so much go down below click the link click the subscribe click the follow join me for the free training and go enjoy some fruit today go enjoy some fruit tomorrow and the next day and keep enjoying your transition i can definitely do that thank you so much for tuning in until next time peace love and breath and before you go right here there's another video that has been selected specifically for you click right here right now now we'll see you over there <laughs>